Mushy Mushy Peeps, it's Chris Valena and welcome back to the channel today. I need you to just go ahead and hit that thumbs up button right now because I got a banger. Yeah. We vlogging today. I just touched down in Houston, Texas. Now, if you're an OG, you know this is pretty much my home ground. This is where I grew up. So I'm going to be driving around places I used to live and stuff. But today's video, I'm going into my childhood storage unit to see if my trading cards are still in there. I know there's one box in there and I don't know what's in it. And today I'm going to show you guys what's in that box. Honestly, it could vary from a thousand dollars worth of cards at least or maybe Maybe even a hundred thousand. Without further ado, let's go. In my neighborhood, my old neighborhood, this is where I used to hoop with the boys. Yes, sir. Good times, man. Got my first dunk right here. It's from my old house. My old house right here. Jeez. It's my neighbor. Never met him. <laughs> All right. Inside this storage unit is my trading cards. I used to collect heavy when I was a kid from like 2002 to like 2008. My parents said that, you know, I have a box full of old cards and I wonder if I could find some gems. So, all right, we gotta do some digging. I see this already says cards on there. So we'll rip this open. But before that, there's an autographed basketball here. This is, it has my dad's stuff in there. He played overseas professional ball. So he's got a lot of his old stuff and I hear he left his cards in here too, so I gotta find those. There's binders. Holy moly. Oh my gosh. Oh! <laughs> Yo, LeBron James, this is in his rookie year, but we already found one. UD Rivals, let's see what's in here. No way, no way. Wow, the whole Upper Deck collection, Carmelo, then got this nice king of the court, Bron James. Hey, that's fire though. To find that off the rip, I'm getting a little nervous. So, oh, baseball storage box. What's in here, boys? Uh, literally baseball <laughs> I don't know shit about baseball. What the hell? Oh, we're getting into the binders. We got a whole upper deck set. See, when I was a kid, I would go for the complete collection. This is 2002, so I think this rookie year was like Yao Ming. Oh, look, Michael Jordan Wizards. Oh my gosh, Akima Lajuan on the Raptors. Oh, Matrix. Oh, oh, damn. These cards are sick. If I have the trio of LeBron in here, that would be crazy. This binder's kind of heat, so that means we're heating up. Oh, this is a big one. This is a big one. This has the heat. Got a purple refractor shack. The fuck? There's too much. Too many sleeves. Might have to take this home and get on a table or something. Got a coat. <laughs> Okay, I might have found something crazy. Oh, LeBron rookie! We found it! We got the whole class. Oh, Yao Ming. One, two, three. Damn, this card's fucked though. These are terrible condition. I would order it in their draft pick. So first pick, second pick, third pick, fourth pick, fifth, sixth. Didn't have the seventh. <gasps> Is that a Kobe rookie? Is that a Kobe rookie? Bro. Oh! Who cares, Kobe? Oh my god, I found a Kobe rookie. I gotta put this in the top order. Ladies and gentlemen, I have found a Kobe Bryant rookie card. Let's go. I am finding gems, boys. Oh, shake it for me. Don't put that in. My type, put that Dude, in. Dude, no. Yao Ming rookie. Why'd you say it like that? I didn't say it like anyway. Don't be weird. Is this a Mike Bibby rookie card? Oh my god, top's finest. Michael Oloa Candy Clipper stand it up. Rip Hamilton, rookie. Got a Stefan Marbury. Jesus. Calvin Booth. Lamar Odom. And y'all said I was a casual collector. We got LeBron and Carmelo. Another rookie sighting. And, oh, Gilbert Arenas rookie? No way, this is a Ralph Sampson rookie card. Okay, heating up. That is gonna do it. All right. So far, the only gym we found is a few LeBron rookie cards, a Kobe Bryant rookie card. And after scavenging through all these boxes, finally found another box. Finally got it out of there. LeBron, come home. <laughs> huh? <laughs> what we have here is a completed Pops 2003-2004 complete collection. Let's go ahead and skip to the goldness. Oh, so guys, what I have here is the gold and the normal version. Whole set. Oh, there's the White Howard rookie card. Bang. Oh my gosh. Big Bertha. Wait. What? <laughs> I was an artist back then. What is that? I was an artist what back is in that? the day. I 
think that was Lamar Odom. Maybe me. I don't know. Oh, we got auto cards. Victory binder, upper deck MVP, another Kobe card. Got a Michael Jordan card. Got a Chris Webber when he called the timeout and sold. Guys, I was about that life back in the day, man. Got a few more. 2006. Oh, LaMarcus Aldridge rookie. What the? 2K cards. What the? Oh, it's a numbered Dean Smith. All right, one more binder. Oh, oh, oh Yu-Gi-Oh. It's all Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> it's all Yu-Gi-Oh, what the fuck? Blue eyes, white dragon, where you at? Bro, are these worth anything? Let me know down below. I don't know anything about old Yu-Gi-Oh cards, but. Ladies and gentlemen, I think we have found what I've been here looking for, the LeBron James top loaded rookie cards. Bring them out. Ugh, look at that card collection. Oh, please let these be the last two boxes because if it's not in here, this is it. This is all or nothing. This is my dad's collection. This is from like the 70s or some shit. So we'll open that one last. Please, LeBron. LeBron, this could pay off all of my taxes. We got beanie babies in here. Is this a rare beanie baby? I hear these go for some, some pennies. This might just be like a $50,000 box right here, man. Oh my God, bro. Look at this. 2K7 exclusive cards with cheat codes. See, back in the day when boxes were 10 bucks, man, you could get so many cards. All right, what's in here? This is Dusty. Oh, Kobe, I keep getting Kobe cards, bro. Let's go. Paul Pierce, Bowman. Oh, a Dirk Tops Chrome. Let's go. I'm heating up. Oh, we got some figurines. Got a Kobe figurine, bro. Dude, and a Vince Carter. Oh my goodness, guys. Just cards for days and a pack. Tops pack. I was ripping. Is this another Kobe card? Sleeve it. We gotta sleeve that. Got a wallet in here. All right. See the wallet. Oh my. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Show us. Oh. Who's that? Stud. Who is that? Oh. Stud muffin. I got, I got Target gift card and the incredible pizza. What do you know about that? Oh. 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 Another beanie baby. Not that. No, I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, baby. Legendary Dragon Ball cards. I thought I'd never find you. Oh, baby. Blue eyes, white dragon hollow, baby. Unopened pack. Unopened pack. No way. I have unopened NFL packs from 1990. Who went crazy in the 90s? This is actually getting crazy. Oh, we got top loaders. They're disgusting. Greg Oden. Ew. Oh my. Al Horford. Oh, okay. <laughs> Katie. Oh, on the back. What the fuck? No, I did not do this. Am I stupid? I put two cards in one top loader. No, 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 no. <laughs> LeBron James rookie and Carmelo right there. Oh my goodness. I don't know what condition this is in, but oh my God, these cards look gross. Fuck. I gotta stop it right here. I gotta go in a calm controlled area, not in this non-ventilated AC, non-existent controlled storage unit. I can't even speak English. And another Kobe card. All right, guys, there's one more box. My dad's collection. Oh boy, come, come. If you look at this, I used to have Beckett magazines to check prices when I was younger. See what I could flip, but my dad was on it, boy. Oh my. Look at this, series one, 1993. This is when I was born. James Worthy, Scotty Pippen. So he just been ripping packs and then kept it in the pack. Wow, there's two golds in every pack. I see the golds are missing. So they must be in here somewhere. We open up. There's just boxes filled with cards, bro. Oh my goodness. Thanks, Dad. He's gonna be like, nah, I saw your video. You're gonna have to give those back, but no takes back, so we shook on it. Sorry. And we back. Guys, I went through all of the boxes, and wow, I have found some gems. I have an unopened Topps hockey pack. And then some more NFL pro set from the 90s. And then that's not it. We got hobby packs, tops expectations. Who remembers that? This was expensive. All right, so let me just show you guys some stuff that I found. This is a 2006 LeBron. And we got some more LeBron cards. LaMarcus Aldridge press pass. It's kind of like the draft picks now. I found a lot of Kobe cards, so that's always nice. Found a LaMarcus Aldridge. Very nice. Guys, surprisingly, the condition on all of these cards is actually not bad at all. 
Rudy Gay rookie card. I found this nice Magic Johnson cards. Now, over here, those boxes is gonna be another video. Over on my LSK Trading Cards channel, I'm gonna open those up and just kinda go through what's in those boxes, see if we find any gems. Then I found this Yao Ming Black Tops card. This is a third year, but it's numbered. I don't have a lot of like numbered cards and I thought it was cool for this like 111. Then I found this. Oh boy. Now this isn't a PSA 10 because I, I analyzed the corners and as you can see that corner is not good at all but lebron james carmelo anthony bang matrix let's go one two and three hmm. and i found a game floor they don't really do this anymore where players played on the game floor they would take pieces and put it on cards oh this goes for some money if it's a psa 10 now this was actually very good condition and along with that got the kobe oh guys the kobe bryant rookie card yes and this this is in great condition. I mean, dude, just looking at the corners, they look nice. The centering is very phenomenal. So I actually am gonna grade this. Oh, and it just heats up right here. LeBron James Gold Edition Ops Rookie Card in. Look at that right there. Kevin Durant Rookie Card. Now, I was a little kid, so <laughs> I'm about to show you something where I would put one card like this, and then I'd put another card. So when you flipped it, it looked like this in one top loader. I don't even know what the point was for the top loader, but I basically squeezed it in there. My mom found this Jim Mint graded Alex Rodriguez card. And I don't know what grading company, advanced grading? I don't think that AGS. Yeah, never heard of them, but pretty cool. I found a Jordan card. Did I show you guys this Dwight Howard rookie card? We found this nice little die cut, Vince Carter, Kobe. Got this press pass rookie, J.R. Smith. I thought this was cool. Then, oh. Ooh, some bangers right here. Carmelo Anthony Fleer and LeBron James Fleer. Found those. They were in a binder though. So hopefully the uh, condition isn't too bad there. Got another card here. LeBron James. LeBron's Diary. I collected a lot of LeBron rookie cards. Got this whole box. I'm going to go through on my LSK trading cards. Found some Dragon Ball cards. I found a lot of T-Mac cards. I don't know if you guys knew this, but um, T-Mac was my favorite player growing up. An unopened Naruto pack. Oh, Oh yeah, let me know if I should open this. Under here, we got some jersey cards. I didn't want to take them out because not gonna lie, it's kind of gross, but I thought this was very funny right here. <laughs> a script print MJ Auto, and you see my little kid ass tried to put Sharpie over it so it looked like a signature, and little did I know that was not gonna work. Got this rookie Chris Kamen jersey patch, but here's some Matrix cards that I found. I still have some pretty cool ones like Carmel Hello, Darko and Chris Bosch. I got this cool like refractor. This was like a cool MJ card I found. Ooh, this WWF. I had to hide this card from my parents. Then this, I literally shoved in this top loader. Like I can't even move it. And it's really gross and it's Jermaine O'Neal, so who cares? T-Mac, numbered, 100. You love to see that. Darius Miles, another favorite player of mine growing up. And look at this. I don't know if this came with the card, but that is pretty sick. It's kind of trippy. Found another like Michael Jordan tops card. Oh, this I shoved in there bad. Can't get it out. This was a rare T-Mac card I regret putting in there, but hey, once you full send, you gotta just keep it. And then got a nice D-Wade gold edition rookie card. And look at that. You flip it, got Jeff Green. Yeah, I'll fix these guys. I will fix these. Chris Bosh, bang. Gold edition with a Mike Conley. Got a Carmelo gold edition with an Al Horford rookie. And this is a nice, clear, lucky 13 D Wade rookie card. Got that gold medallion. And this is why I believe I have the LeBron James rookie somewhere, bro. Because I have the D Wade in the Chris Bosh. Gotta find that LeBron. I don't know what I did. Maybe I sold it, but I didn't find it today, so it's not coming home with me. Another thing I'm gonna show you guys, one sec. My dad had these jumbo packs. I just don't believe these were open. For this 1993-34, there is some packs as well. I'm gonna open that on my trading card channel as well. So if you guys wanna just comp that out for yourself, comment down below. I think I hit a nice couple thousand. Definitely got some cards I need to take home, clean up a bit, send into grading and see what I can get. But I think this was a successful trip nonetheless and happy to get my cards back.
Got my uh, True Creator cards dropping, so it's pretty cool seeing like basketball cards that I grew up collecting and then making my own cards. And anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this. Give this a thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you guys again soon. Peace.